Okay, as you can see, I'm back in the car. Um, nice little pausing session to be fair. Nice and mighty convenient interview. But now we are going to slip over to Cali Sports Nutrition. It's about a 10 minute drive. Um, I'll show you one of the coolest supplement shops known to man. See you in 10. Well, it won't be 10, Dan, because you're driving over and you're going to edit this video. <laughs> Hey guys, we're here at CSN. This is the guy with the world's largest hands, Mark Robinson. And his little one, Millie. Uh, Mark's my prep coach, like I mentioned earlier on the way up. So I've come in for a checkup and uh, see what he says. Yeah, so far we were six weeks out, weren't we? Six weeks, yeah. yeah just about. Weeks. Dan's coming in, all, <coughs> coming in all the places we expect to right about now. Lower back, and tightening up. Abs finally starting to show. Are they? You know, but uh, everything's going in the right direction for Dan to surpass the condition that he had at the, uh, the at the Welsh Grand Prix. So uh, couldn't be happier with it. The stage has got a few dark days and uh, low carb weeks coming up in around about the three four weeks mark. But uh, nothing Dan can't handle it. I will give it a go. I will give it a go. But uh, any changes now or just at the moment? Not the moment for this week. We'll be keeping things the same, and then um, when we uh, have the check in later on in the week, then. Uh, We'll take Bad a good enough. look at you and see where your lower back and abs are right there in the trouble spots and then uh, make the changes and hopefully cool. happen, change will happen. Thanks for Mike. Cheers bro. Right, no worries. Hey, I'm on the drive home. It's been about 45 minutes and I'm getting tired now guys. I'm not going to lie. It's currently about half past one. I start work at half past two. So I think I've got about a half hour break before I start work and then I'm in work for about eight hours. Like I said, I got two classes tonight. I'm not gonna be able to show you guys much of my work, um, but wherever I can, I will. I'll sneak off. I'll give you a little update. Um, hope you like what you've seen so far. Um, obviously, drop me a few comments. Let me know what you want to see. If there's anything like training videos, special recipes, anything like that, just drop me a little message, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. You know that. But for now, I got about another 20 minutes. I'll show you guys the sights. I'll eat my rice cake. So that is third of a burn done and dusted. That's my first class of the night. Um, I couldn't really show you guys all too much. There was just too many and I couldn't get permission of everyone just in time. Um, but as you can see, it was a bit like an Asandi style class. There was plenty of um, plyometric work. It's all bodyweight exercises. There's a few med balls thrown in. So it's a really good sweat. I'm still a little bit out of breath. Sweat is starting to dry out because it's about 20 minutes past class. Um, but for me now, I've got about an hour's break. I'm just gonna get a little bit of food in. Um, I believe it's meal five, which was, as you've seen, post-workout two, um, which was chicken, uh, 40 grams of rice and a bit of veg. I'm gonna get that down me. Um, hopefully it'll settle just in time for kettlebells, which is in class number two. But for now, enjoy, and I'll see you in a bit. Right, as you can see, this is why I love my job. Um, just finished third burn, as you know, and then I got dragged into a spin class. So I've just done 27 kilometers on a bike. I've got a 10 minute rest and then kettlebells.
strong pump. We can lift both your feet. Push.
Hey guys, so that was my third and final class of the day. I thank God for that. Um, a second spin class really caught me off guard. Um, I am feeling rather weak, rather tired. I'm looking forward to going home. I've literally just got to set a class up. Um, I've got to till up and I'm going to go home and get something to eat. But for now, as far as my work goes, um, I'm done for now. I'll see you back in my house. Oh, let's go home. Hey guys, I'm finally home in my lovely little kitchen. I've had my last post, uh, last meal, meal six, which was the 220 grams of chicken I had here. Um, I chucked a bit of veg in it. Um, a little bit of almonds, but now it's my pre-bed snack, so I'm going to show you guys what I do for my pre-bed snack. I have total low-fat Greek yogurt, so what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to pop um, 170 grams of Greek fat yogurt in it, so let me just open this bad boy up. Let's take the little lid back. My girlfriend who's holding the camera made a mess of this. I'm not blaming you, don't worry. Right, so I'm just gonna mix this up a little bit. And we're looking for roughly about 170 grams, yeah? Dollop. 102. 128. Oh, a bit too much. Oh, look. Ah! So close yet so far. So as you can see there now, I got 170 grams of low fat Greek yogurt. Then, one of the best inventions known to man, nuts and more chocolate almond butter. I'm going to add about 15 grams of this. For some reason it doesn't quite register on my scales, but I'll show you what I mean. Look at that. This is pure heaven. It's dangerous. So as you see, about that much. Get it in. Bit of extra protein. Give it a lick. Num. <laughs> KC, pre bed. I'm going for gold standard um, optimal nutrition. I'm going for creamy vanilla. You can mix it up, you can use any flavour. You can try banana. Uh, chocolate works really well, but tonight is vanilla. I think I've got enough in here for one scoop. Let's have a look. Oh, look at that, one scoop. All gone. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to mix this up a little bit. Just get the first bit mixed up. <gasps> Made a mess. I blame the cameraman. Get the first bit mixed up. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take it over to here. A little dash of water. And then let's get back in the light so you can see what's going on. I'm just going to mix that around. Yeah, don't just do what I done. Take your time, mix it around. It sticks to the sides quite a bit, so make sure you do really get in there. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, look at it. You can taste it already. And it tastes good. Right, guys. That is looking lovely. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to pop that in the freezer. We're going to leave it in the freezer for about 10 minutes. I'm going to come back, enjoy it, and go to bed. But for now, that is done. Okay, so it has been about 10 minutes. I'm going to grab my lovely little dessert. I'm going to pop you over here. And I'm going to pass my camera to my lovely girlfriend, wearing my hoodie. Nice. 
if we take that bit. Alright guys, this is hardened up, so it's time for me to eat it. Um, as far as filming goes, my day is done. You've seen my breakfast, you've seen my day, what I get up to, what I'm doing. There's not much, apart from going to the toilet, that's probably the only thing you haven't seen. Um, like, share, subscribe, give me some comments, you know, let me know what you want to see, and I'll get it up as soon as I can. But for now, it's time for me to go. Just want to say thanks to my lovely sponsors, Optum Nutrition, Machine Fitness. You guys look after me. CSN, you're great to me. Thank you guys, um, and I will see you soon.